that was potentially life-saving for something that we had no idea that he had. It's one of those stories you hear in the news of a kid collapsing on the soccer field and not being able to wake up. Jill Piazza is a very grateful mother. Her 16-year-old son, Ethan, a competitive soccer player, was diagnosed with and treated for a congenital heart condition called Wolf-Parkinson-White syndrome, or WPW. Though he had no symptoms, Ethan had an extra electrical pathway in his heart. It can lead to a very rapid heart rate, two to 300 beats per minute, and it can lead to more lethal arrhythmias, including sudden cardiac death in rare cases. At Daytona International Speedway over the summer, the Volusia County School District, working with Advent Health, offered free electrocardiogram screenings to local athletes. To be safe, the Piazza family took advantage. I just didn't even know I had it. Ethan, like his mother, was shocked. He's played soccer since he was four, is on the Seabreeze High School varsity oh, team. Never any problem. The family figured it was a false positive result until doctors confirmed Ethan's condition. Playing soccer, club, and high school, I could have had a cardiovascular episode just any time, you know, heart attack or you know, anything of that sort. Ethan underwent a heart ablation at Advent Health for Children in Orlando in September after delays due to COVID. His mom says it was worth the wait. It completely kills the pathway, prevents it from transmitting electrical impulses, and it's essentially a cure. It's very relieving just knowing what could have happened and that we prevented it safely. Ethan's back on the field, scored his first goal of the varsity season this week. He is healthy, his mom happy. Don't hesitate, get your kids screened because it could save their life, absolutely. In Ormond Beach, Volusia County, Claire Metz, West 2 News.